Little Space fans, I'm posting this short video to keep you guys up to date on what's going on with me and to let you know why I haven't posted a video in a couple of weeks. Now ordinarily I wouldn't find this kind I would find this kind of video unnecessary because I've never really considered what goes on in my personal life to be all that interesting enough to tell people about. So usually what I do when I'm really busy is I just go several weeks or even months without posting any videos. But lately things have been changing for me and especially with how I deal with this channel. As of this date, as of the date of this video, I have almost 10,000 subscribers. And it seems incredible to me that since I uploaded my first video in 2006 that this would ever happen. I certainly never expected to be interacting with so many people like this, but now I feel a bit of responsibility towards you. I mean, there are many space fans watching every video I put up and saying the most incredibly kind things to me. And this response has sort of cultivated a sense of connection with many of you, such that I finally understand why many people with such large numbers of subscribers keep connected to their subscribers in this way. Now, the thing is, I'm a very private person. I'm not usually one to let everyone know what I'm up to at any given moment, primarily because I don't think it's all that interesting. I don't tweet about what my favorite cereal is or feel the need to have a million Facebook friends. So with that in mind, I wanted to give you a bit of an update. Now I understand completely if you couldn't care less, but I've not posted a video in a couple of weeks because tomorrow I'm moving to Baltimore, Maryland to begin my new job with the Space Telescope Science Institute. And this is an incredible opportunity for me and in a way fulfills a bit of a lifelong dream of mine to work with the Hubble Space Telescope team. Now I start on Monday. And it seems very fitting that I move into this job now, at this stage in my life. This channel's entire success is built on that telescope, and my Hubble videos were probably what brought you to me in the first place and led you to subscribe. So I guess I feel a little like I've come full circle, and I'm stepping into a position that seems tailor-made for me. I do have more videos in the works. I'm almost done with a video about what it would be like to journey into a black hole. It's inspired by a website run by a former professor of mine at the University of Colorado, Andrew Hamilton. I have the script finished and some of the visuals put together, but I didn't want to rush this out before it was ready, so it probably won't go out until late next week. Okay, so with all of this said, if you're interested, and if you've made it this far into the video, you, a you actually might be, I have started a Twitter thing. Um, I don't put post on it much, but if people start signing up, I may try to do more often. I also have a Facebook page where I'll post some things I think space fans might be interested in and those links will be in the sidebar. Now I'll do my best to be interesting, but one thing I won't do is tweet about breakfast cereals or what shoes I'm wearing today. Well, okay, that's it for now. Uh, wish me luck space fans and I'll talk to you next week.